Today we are discussing the CCNA based interview questions and answers for Cisco Data Center Core Technologies DCCOR. You can download the complete list of CCNA based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on DCCOR is Explain the purpose of Cisco Endpoint Groups EPGs in the context of Cisco ACI and how they are used to define and enforce application centric policies. Your answer should be EPGs in Cisco ACI are logical groupings of endpoints representing sets of devices or workloads that share common policies. They are used to define and enforce application centric policies allowing for the consistent application of rules and configurations across related endpoints. Our next interview question is what is the role of virtual machine FEX VMFEX in a Cisco Unified Computing System UCS and how does it enhance virtual machine networking performance? Your answer should be VMFEX allows direct communication between virtual machines and the physical fabric interconnect in UCS by passing the hypervisor switch. This enhances network performance by reducing the overhead associated with virtual switching, resulting in improved throughput and lower latency. Our next interview question is, how does the Cisco Application Policy Infrastructure Controller Enterprise Module APIC EM contribute to network automation and policy management in a data center? Your answer should be APIC EM is a controller that provides network automation and policy management in a data center environment. It automates tasks such as configuration and troubleshooting, enabling a more agile and responsive network infrastructure. It also supports the application of policies for consistent network behavior. Our next interview question is, what is the role of virtual extensible LAN, VXLAN in a data center network? And how does it address the limitations of traditional VLANs. Your answer should be VXLAN is a tunneling protocol designed to overcome the limitations of traditional VLANs, especially in large scale virtualized environments. It provides a scalable solution for network segmentation by encapsulating layer 2 Ethernet frames within layer 3 UDP packets. VXLAN allows for a much larger address space, enabling the creation of thousands of virtual networks. Our next interview question is, how does the Cisco Nexus 9000 series switch contribute to the evaluation of data center networking? and what features distinguish it in terms of performance and programmability. Your answer should be the Cisco Nexus 9000 series switch is a high performance data center switch that supports both traditional three tire architectures and modern leaf spine architectures. It introduces innovations such as programmability through application-centric infrastructure 
ACI high density 10 slash 25 slash 40 slash 100 gigabyte gigabit Ethernet ports and support for software defined networking SDN technologies. If you are preparing for any Cisco based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid, tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below.